we're the smart people, we don't do this every night. What's 16 times 14? My burps taste like cranberry juice. <laughs> and there's your answer. Would you like to come in for a nightcap? If you're referring to the beverage, you know I don't drink. If you're referring to the hat you don while wearing a nightshirt and holding a candle, I have one. I have you who? It's hard to say no to you who. The name literally beckons. Make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Is someone smoking? Oh, that's just Ricky. You own a smoking monkey? Don't be silly. He's one of the animals in my department's nicotine addiction study. What's he doing here? I'm giving him emphysema. The least I can do is let him hang out and watch cable. Remarkable. Aren't you worried about secondhand smoke? A little. The real danger is him biting my face off while I'm sleeping. <laughs> is he deliberately blowing smoke at me? Yeah, he's kind of an ass. Thank you. May I share something with you that's troubling me? Of course. What's rattling around that big bulbous brain of yours? Priya has essentially nullified my roommate agreement with Leonard, making life in the apartment very uncomfortable for me. And you want me to kill her? Done. No, of course not. But I trained Ricky how to smoke. I can train him to shoot a poison dart. No jury would convict us because people love monkeys. <laughs> I understand the alcohol has stirred up whatever it is that makes girls go wild. But I really need to talk to Smart Amy now. Excuse me. Have you considered that your intelligence might be the very thing causing your dilemma? <laughs> no. What do you think Ricky over here would do if an interloper encroached on his territory? Well, when challenged, monkeys generally assert their dominance through chasing, assault, and a stylized penile display. <laughs> a little outside my comfort zone. You're being too literal. My point is, he would not meekly surrender to the rules, and neither should you. Are you suggesting I play dirty? Yes, dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty. <laughs> Which brings me to our next order of business. Fascinating. I hope you don't take what I'm about to do as a comment on what we just did. Who's to say you shouldn't be dissecting our brains? You really are an ass.